I'm trying to do two things at once in this video assembling this uh, heart shaped thing Oki 1315 with blue LEDs and trying out my new soldering iron that has a nice little feature where you're able to set the temperature I already tried it out so I kind of know it works it melts solder at the lowest settings which is good and uh, yeah let's just plug this in and I'll uh, get the parts wait where's the plug crap I have a proper holder here, but I do have to be careful because it's hot. <laughs> okay, so let's see this uh, bag. So with the other soldering iron, I kind of had to be careful with the, the microchips because I don't know, it released some electricity into the uh, tip, I don't know how to explain it, but I ruined uh, some things, for example on my mechanical keyboard, uh, one backlight is always on, even if I turn the keyboard off, as long as it has power, that light, that one key is on, and that's because I soldered it, so yeah. With this one, there shouldn't be any similar problem because it's with a resistor, there's no magnetic field, there's no BS, so I can start even with the chip, soldering the chip. Come on. Why are chips always uh, with wider legs? Why aren't they bent properly? So the key is there, it's uh, what kind of chip is this? It's uh, an LM358P 22XBLHX, whatever that means. So let's just uh, zoom in, I think I leave it like this on the table and uh, maybe weigh it down with something like a power bank <laughs> which hopefully won't catch on fire let's weigh it down like that do this row is, is it in the worst place possible yes it is so yeah hopefully the soldering iron is hot enough let's see does it melt solder yes it does okay now let's start <coughs> that just went into my mouth let's start soldering you heat it up you push the solder and you have no place to heat it up and push the solder come on like that i'm doing something wrong solder is not coming out of this thing my my hand is slipping on it what who the hell invented this this atrocious plastic box and the solder is uh, sometimes blocks into this hole it doesn't want to come out yeah oops did i do it right any of it let me put down the soldering iron and check to see oh the second one is crap but the others are <laughs> fine i guess fine let's see okay now it's fine like that but yeah i don't like this soldering iron this is not a pro uh tool i like the pistol 
Come on, focus. What is this camera doing here? Well, you can work a lot faster. If you get used to it, this came out much better. Even though the focus is bad here. The second row, this row came out a lot better. So yeah, it takes a little pra practice. I will practice some more. So, the transistor goes in here into the SB whatever place like there can I do that because they are much closer together and uh, let me just why why doesn't this focus did I disable autofocus that may be the problem here yeah I kind of ruined this where did I have a piece of paper let me wipe it so you can actually wipe a soldering iron tip in paper but I don't know why nobody uses that trick People use the proper stuff that's uh, supposed to be better. Uh, sponge or something, I don't know. Come on. I can't get the middle one. Why is this being so difficult? Let me try it the other way. Crap. Now it's stuck to the... <laughs> yeah, now I did it, I think. Poorly. But it's making contact, so... Yeah. This, this is a fail. So with this soldering iron, I think you can do uh, chips. That's the best for chips. But... With all kinds of stupid legs here and there. SI power. Is that switch one? Power. And you put it like this. Yeah, I don't think it matters. But uh, it has to be seated right. Oops, it fell out. Man, I don't like this soldering iron. I think I don't like it. Because I can't hold it. What the hell? It's Everything is moving. Okay, like that. And put some here. Come on, that's done. Yeah, I need a better tactic here. I didn't show you that, but uh, that was dumb. I need something that hold, will hold the, what I'm soldering. Because this is just free. Everything is moving. That's not great. So everything needs to be coordinated, like I, the release of the solder and the pushing of the solder and the soldering iron, it all has to be done perfectly. So I think these are fine, not touching or every, anything. The middle one is bad, this one. Now it's better, okay. Oh boy, I don't like this. Oh, and the 
<laughs> and it's crooked <laughs> because I couldn't push it I was just relying on gravity so look it's not straight can I push it in like this nope whatever yeah I'll fix that later probably Yeah, I just ruined things now. Let me get the solder sucker. Let me try that out. So, uh, where's the short? Here's the short. I heat it up and I suck it out. Okay, that worked. <laughs> okay. And here. Yeah, that's not the problem. Yeah, this sucks. So yeah, let's continue. In let's continue with the sucky sucky procedure. Where does the potentiometer come? The potentiometer goes here. Like this. So how long you supposed to leave the legs for this? I don't know. I never put in one of these. So just like that. Oh yeah, it has a fixed height. The legs give it the exact height. So whatever. Let's just push it in. Yeah. That's dumb. What did I do there? Oh boy. <laughs> yeah, you can't see it, but I did something dumb. Yep, it's dumb. But uh, I don't get it. It's bad. My tactic is not working yet. Okay, so a few solder joints later. Let's see what else do we put in. So the time limit is at 20 minutes. If I don't finish until then, then I leave the, I'll do the uh, LEDs off camera because you know that sucks. That's boring. So. The 47 nanofarad or picofarad, whatever farad. Uh, the negative one goes to the top like this. And you push it in. Then you try to solder it and mess it up. Like uh, this. Yep, and I also joined the two legs <laughs> with a tiny blob of solder. Why do I do these things? Okay, now it's separated, but uh, I may have done some serious damage here. Oh well, <laughs> maybe I'll have to fix that, but uh, yeah. This will be the input and do I have another capacitor? No, just the resistors, which are all the same. How are these? Uh, let me put down the soldering iron and uh, so you need a uh, hundred K, 10 K. 47k man I have to measure those because I don't know the codes so yeah uh, I have to leave you with this uh, I don't like the soldering iron I like this 
the project seems nice, I mean the soldering kit, whatever you call it. It will be a bunch of blinking uh, LEDs in a heart shape. So yeah, I will, I will make more uh, another video when it's working. 